Hello and welcome to the Heat Signature Daily Challenge. Today it is the 17th of November and we are killing three sovereign officers while avoiding alarms. We are shaky, which is not great, but we do have a shotgun. Technophobe, which is also not great. Vindictive and X Foundry, so maybe we'll get extra uses, but we cannot rely on it. Uh, yeah, this is going to be fun. Got Quickfire Shotgun, which is not great for avoiding alarms. Yeah. Can use crash beams in emergencies, those. And emergency shields in emergencies as well. Okay, target fleas. It doesn't matter. Defender could be something we have to worry about. Mini center guns. Not a fan of that. We can at least get extra shotguns. And we are killing. Do not have to worry about bringing anyone back alive. Oh, and we have a tick. Okay, so no bash dashing today, at least to start with. Which makes things quite difficult. I would like that item, but I have to go many rooms out of my way for it. You have an item, but that means we have to take care of you. And you've got a you've got an automatic weapon, a shotgun, which is really nice, but it's loud. Which is a bit less nice. So let's do first things first. Walk over here. And we need to We need to get this key without setting off the alarm. With only potentially two shotguns available to us. Now if I shot a shotgun right now. There's a good chance I'd hit both of them, and then I could take your gun and shoot. Eh, not a huge fan of that. But once you pass this corner, I can't take any shots. I might have to do it and rely on the crash beam for an emergency backup. So let's see, I could step in here, grab your gun, and then go up here, but there's no way I'm getting over here and through the door without you shooting at me. And I have to deal with you some... If I take you all out, then I can go down here instead. And this is a quick fire shotgun, so maybe it'll be fine. All right. Do this and it is quiet and let's see if we get lucky well that was the worst luck <laughs> available to us okay so right now our biggest concern is you shooting because you have a loud weapon Okay. Okay, that's that's a good spread at least. Okay, let's see if we can Okay, we're leaving this gun behind. Okay, so I just need to get to absolute... Oh, I was going to get to point blank range, but... Let's shoot you first. Then get absolutely as close as we can to shoot you. And we got a bunch of guns. And we didn't use any of our crash beams. So that is a win. I'm still 
tempted to get that, but it's so far out of the way. I take this route. Uh, yeah, it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, as opposed to 3. It's 9 extra seconds. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, okay, so depending depending on what all this these items are, we'll decide whether we go for it. Because if we go through here, take out the pilot, then we can blow a hole in the ship to escape faster. So that we're not taking up the whole amount of time. And then am I going for this? That there, I don't, I don't, I will, we'll go with, uh, da, 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 da. this is difficult, this is very difficult. <laughs> yeah, I'm not liking that, I'm not liking that room at all. And I've realized that this is also a poor decision, but I think this will work out because we've got shotguns. Oh, please. <laughs> Okay, these are being some rude, rude shotguns. Shoot right in the middle, hope that I get at least one of you. Okay, that is much better. Got an extra shotgun. Got the key. Got another gun. And we friggin' need to <laughs> assassinate you while you're protected. Okay, so what we're gonna do is unleash the captain or pilot or whatever they're called. Get your attention. Hey, look at me. It's a person that you don't like. And I'm leading you. Where could it be to? Yo. Look at me. Come on. We're taking a nice step outside. Just join me. Okay. I'm going to hope that I don't get shot. Okay, okay. Nice and gracefully. I'll let you walk a little bit more in to be careful. All right, pilot, out of chair. No more alarms can be sent. So we shoot out the window. Yeah. I hate it when it <laughs> pulls me out from the corner. I need to figure out why it does that. So let's try shooting ourselves back into the pod. Okay, that's good. That's good at least. All right, now we can teleport to the nearest star luck. We get a grenade launcher. 
a timed grenade launcher. I'm gonna pick it up and drop it so that it stays in the pot a bit. Um, but otherwise, that's that's not a very good thing. All right, so we've got absolutely nothing helpful, so we're gonna go for this and finish, finish, finish the job. Okay, as I'm walking down here, I'll get this paired. Let's. Alright, one of those hits. I'll take this gun. And I'll walk a little bit farther. How did you still clip through that? It doesn't matter. Hopefully this doesn't pull me out. <laughs> Hopefully I didn't shoot too soon. And hopefully this trying to dock with the thing right there. Alright, yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Unless it bugs out. Oh. See, if I'd known that was there, I would have gone for it first. Or at least this way I still have... Uh, three charges for it. Oh, okay. And we're off. 17 seconds, that's gonna be more like 20. But such is the way when you do not have things to abuse. Future ships will go much better, unless we screw up. In which case they will not. Okay, emergency shield, heat sensors. I do not like the shields. Or the heat sensors in this case. We can pick up more sh Oh, we've got melee weapons. That is relevant. Do we have a way... We do not have a way to open a secondary door. It's locked, but there is none. Okay. So I think I want to take out both of these people. Get the sword. Run back up here, get the crate. Or could potentially get the crate on the way back. And that would require using a slipstream, probably. Let's run down here. Get pretty close to you. See, it's only you two in here. So, gonna shoot at you first. That might miss. So we'll shoot again. That looks like it hits. And we'll give you the final shot. Luckily, since we're slipstreaming, this shotgun uh, goes by really quick. I'm not sure if that's hitting. I guess all of them go by pretty quick. Alright, looks good. So, run up here. Start filling our items with stuff dropped. And then, yeah, this is going to be the fastest route. Oh, back up slipstream. We'll stack the pod with that on our way out. Can I just steal this and get out? I'm going to steal this and try and get out. I 
successfully stole that and tried to get out. Okay, so I wish I had my pod moving before this. One of these spots would have been a good time to do that. Makes me wonder if it would be faster to just run back to the pod. No, I already got the crate. Okay. So the most important thing is to just start blasting. And then I started blasting. <laughs> the rain of bullets. Okay, okay. Bullets are gonna hit them and gonna go out the window. Which means we can grab this extreme range visitor. That's pretty good. Okay, so we'll run out here. Uh, I did not mean to pick them up. What was I thinking? Eh. <sighs> well, yeah, I was trying to remote control. There's so many options right here that I just was not thinking straight. Not very often that you see the fly of the ship. And then we will that dash oh, I do not have dash dash. Then we will bash dash and jeez. I was hoping that would still be there. Oh, rip. <laughs> Goodbye, pod. Okay. Slow down. Get moving over there. While I slowly walk out. Alright, alright. Then we can go back here. Oof. Get some backup blades. Um, okay. So we can drop a bunch of stuff. What on the ship is things that we want? This is the most important one. Yeah, we'll take that as well. And then now we can just fill our inventory with stuff. Right? Yeah, that looks good. Okay, so my little slip up there didn't cost me too much time. Probably just about a second. Maybe two. Okay, we got shields everywhere, which makes the shotguns much less appealing. And we're definitely going to let you leave before we start messing with items. Okay. I thought I left this on the pod. Weird. Okay, taking those, I'll take... Eh. Uh, yeah, that's that's gonna be about it. Everything else is on the pod currently. We've got a secure entrance, but I don't think we have any. No, we do have something to get in. We have a single extreme range visitor, and we have a target that is unordinarily close. However, this is pretty long. 
So extreme range. I'm right here. Will get me to at least this section. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We've we can definitely do that, right? We've got to be able to. these items okay so let's pick up this first we need this uh, concussive shotgun it's not gonna be great and none of these are really needed the emergency shield actually pretty nice Especially with all of these sentry guns. Okay, so any dangers we need to worry about. Sentry guns, we've got the E shield. No one's gonna get killed by any sentry guns accidentally. So you go in here, steal the key. Go in here, steal the key. Go in here, steal the key. Go in here, steal the key, and somehow get out without setting off the alarm. This might be where I use all my crash beams. Especially since I do need to kill you. <laughs> okay. So, take this, don't need the long blades quite yet. All right. Slipstream, run down to the corner. Extreme range, yeah, that's gonna get us far. Uh, let's use this shield first. Oh, I completely forgot about X Foundry. We might get a second extreme range visitor, which will speed us up even more. Nope, just the one. There's a decent chance that you start to set off the alarm. But if you do, we can just crash you. Actually, you're gonna shoot your gun if you do that. Hmm, that's a problem. Let's hope we don't have to deal with it. not gonna bother with this as I just need to run in here as fast as possible steal the key hope that you don't shoot at me all right so at this point do I try and get the pod down here so that I can get out before it tries to pull me back or do I just let it pull me back might as well just let it pull me back not much we're missing here Okay, crash beam one, crash beam two, crash beam three. And doors are closed. You, in fact, still have ears. So we're not gonna shoot. We're just gonna go straight for you. Now we have slipstream. Eh, I'm gonna play it safe. And just start stabbing everyone. That missed, didn't it? Oh, no, it, it hit and hit me. Uh, I need... I need my sword. I need my sword, please. I'll pass the time by stunning you. There we go, there we go. Just 
stabbing you. Uh, pick up my stuff. And then stabbing you. And they're, they're all uh, suspicious of something, but they're not going to check it out. So it's fine. And we didn't set off the alarm from that. We probably could have just ran... No. No, because we have the visitor going, the ship stays loaded even after we leave. So the alarm still most likely would have gone off. So this was the best option. <laughs> I should have crashed this door, but it looks like they're not going to walk through. So let's return to pod. Look at all this this wonderful mess of things we've got. Return to pod, make sure that this unloads. All right, we are good. Oh yeah, the only major time improvement there would have been if we went through, went for the crate first on ship one. Still got a 599. Very nice. How close are we to a 300? Not close at all. The wood. I'm trying to think. So we'd have to get under 16 seconds to get a 300. We had five on the last one, seven before that. Could have probably got that down to six or five. There's no way we were doing ship one in under four seconds. So, a score of 300, not possible on this one. So, prop may be possible to get. Eh, I'm not sure if you could get under 10 on one. That was a lot of rooms and you needed the key first. Yeah, no, that wasn't happening. So, this is the results so far still have much of the day left let's see how yesterday ended up all right yep got the minus 15 style points as it was a timed daily was this yesterday this day the 17th yeah today's the 17th um, I cannot remember what happened yesterday. Oh, right. It was super late. This was the brick. The brick that we tried to use. But, yeah. It was pointed out. Oh, man. I'm terrible with names. Yeah. I'm sorry, but it was pointed out in the comments that uh, because I was approaching it, f the ship from the front, you actually have to be a fair bit farther out in order for it to actually explode, which makes perfect sense. And yeah, definitely was not going to risk trying to brick from even further out from that. But still got a minus 15 is quite a ways better than anyone else but we had bash dash or something so that's to be expected until we get other people using bash dashing and the like but all that rambling to say I took first Harif Green and second Lassar third Philly G123 and fourth and I go unseen in fifth. I've been seeing you lately. You were, you were in the top five the day before as well, I believe. All right. And with that, we have finished today's daily challenge. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you tomorrow.